No, no, no. Oh my God. <laughs> Chief just jumped inside of the back of the truck. He came up to the back and he jumped all the way over the tailgate inside the truck. You really are excited to go. We got bumpers in here. We got Samuel, we got myself, we got Chief and Dixie. We're gonna do some dog training today. And I'm gonna show you guys a really simple exercise when you're trying to teach your dog uh, how to follow your hand signals to go different directions. And some people call it handling, some people call it casting. We're gonna walk out this road here. At the end, there's a T with the road going to the right and to the left. We'll use the road for the directions that we want to send the dogs so that they have a clear path of where to run down. You can also do this like in a grass field and you can mow strips like a, a cross or a T or like a trident type symbol um, to work on send, sending the dog in different directions. Here's the T, so we have a road going that way, road going that way, and road going this way. So when Chief was a puppy, we started out really small and I would, I would throw like a treat or a shed, like five feet to his right, five feet to his left, and then I would work on doing hand signals to control which way he would look and then send him one way or the other. So I'm gonna put a bumper out this way. Throw that one over there. And then over on this side and throw another one. And he knows where they are because he just watched both of them. And just the hand signal like this, just straight up, just, um, tells him to look at me and also to sit or to stop. And then I'm gonna move my hand to the right. Chief. And I'm gonna walk up here so that he comes straight back to me, right here. He should sit at my side. Thank you, stay. I'm gonna keep him in that same exact spot. And now I'm gonna send him to the left using my left hand. Chief. I'm gonna walk back up here. Bring here, Chief. Right here. And he should sit and hold. Good boy. See him wagging his tail. Thank you. So that's how I started Chief as a puppy. Just sending him right and left. And if he was strong going to the right, like he wanted to go to the right every time, then I'd start sending him to the left and I wouldn't let him go to the right. And just trying to teach him you know, go the way that I send you, if you can see a mark or not. So another exercise to teach Chief to run exactly where I point him is to put some dummies out in a straight line. So I'm gonna take this white dummy, I'm gonna walk way out here, I'm gonna put the white dummy out there, I'm gonna put a gray dummy there, I'm gonna walk back here just a little bit and put a gray dummy right there on the ground. So now we have three dummies in a straight line out the road. Come here, Chief. Here. I'm gonna line him up with my hand. Chief. And he'll go get one of the dummies. He skipped the first one. Right here, here. Thank you. I'm gonna send him again. Chief! Send him straight out in the line. Here. Thank you. I'm just tossing him behind me. I'll send him one more. Chief! And this was the farthest one out there. Hey, bring it here. Here. Come here. Right here. Good boy, sit. Good boy. So that's a good exercise to teach him how to run straight out the direction that you send him. If you keep doing that and you just make him farther and farther out, then he'll learn to trust where you're sending him and he'll, he should technically just keep going
until he finds something or you stop him and bring him back or stop him and send him one way or another. So if I were to send Chief out and combine these two exercises, I would send him out straight and once he gets perpendicular to wherever the bird or the dummy is, I would do a long whistle and he would sit and turn around and look at me and I would do a hand signal in the direction I want him to go. He's even turning his head right now as I do that. And then I would, I would send him that uh, direction and he would go get the dummy and then he should bring it straight back to me. And so using a road like this gives the dog clear directions of straight lines that he should run in. Chief, uh, I haven't done this a ton with him in the last six months and so as we've been here, the first time I've been sending him, he's been kind of weaving back and forth and he's gradually gotten straighter every time where now he's running straight down the road and he, he knows this exercise and he's got it down. So that's a really simple exercise that you can do. Quick tip for you today, hopefully you enjoyed it. We're gonna do some more training. We have a, a dummy with a feather on it to have some scent so that they can find it. Uh, using their nose and Samuel and I are just going to spend some time out here doing some dog training which is really fun so if you're new to the channel push the subscribe button all the way in click the bell so you get notified and hit the thumb more button down below we'll see you in the next one hats off to you